Shops on Culvert Street, stock goods you won't find in more ripped. So I was at the honeybee. Dancing's all I've got these days. I wonder what's going on. My sister on the You can't. Please? Our daughter deserves to. Planet's a living being. Uh. Seriously? I'm sorry, but it's outside our jurisdiction. Show some spine! Uh, yes, sir! Ma'am, if you don't leave at once, I will be forced to arrest you! Oh, yeah? Go ahead! <sighs> Tifa, you won't believe this! A cerulean drake flew in from the train graveyard, but these two clowns refused to get off their butts and do anything about it! Hey, is that? It is you, the new Merc. Then maybe you can help us out. The Drake is in the old Talagher factory over there. But to reach it, you'll need to get a hold of a watch security key. You should be able to find one inside one of the crates. I forget which, just smash them all. It ain't the Merc himself. Nothing to it. That the key? Yeah. This won't take long. Not at all. Do it.
coming through. Out of our way. <laughs> Brace yourself. Slide. 
Would kill for a shower. And there he is! I knew you were the right man for the job. There's no denying you're the real deal. Not like these idiots with their excuses. Rather have one of you than 20 of them. They're just doing their jobs. Can't expect them to be at your beck and call. What exactly is it you're trying to say, Merc? You need people who can follow orders, too. I see now. Heard you were ex Shinra. Guess I shouldn't be surprised you'd go to bat for your old buddies. Me? I'm just looking out for my people. All there is to it. Hell with you. We can take care of this town ourselves. No more Mercs or Shinra. We'll build up the watch and kick you all out. Another Why job for you, Mark. A certain shopkeeper told me you paid him a visit. Thanks for helping him out. Just so happens there's another job I'd like to offer you. Now that I know you can handle yourself in a fight, you've got a real killer on the loose, you see. A rabid catch dog. Maybe you've heard people talking about it. Shinra Mutt gone feral. Last sighting was in Scrap Boulevard. Think you're up to it? I'll handle it. You're a lifesaver. Doubt anyone else around here stands a chance. Go get him, bud. Is there anyone who can chase off that fuck? Where do you think the damn thing came from, anyway? Don't get yourself hurt.
defender. Yeah. <laughs> 
Just like that, okay? I gotcha. Took care of the dog, did you? Phew, we owe you one. Gotta say, I've never seen a Shinra breed like that before. Out of curiosity, when exactly did it show up? Oh, today. The first reports came in just this morning. Uh, why do you ask? Wait a minute. There's this crazy story about a Shinra research lab, hidden right beneath our feet under the slums. Huh. Really? That's news to me. <laughs> and here I thought you might know something I don't. Well, I guess not. It's a big organization. I'm sure there's lots of secrets I don't know. Yeah, fair enough. You got the bastard. That's good enough for me. Okay, then. That's another solid gig in the books. You know, the whole town is really impressed with what you've done. Keep it up, and you'll have enough work to keep you fed for a lifetime. All well, thanks to you. And don't you forget it. So where do we get paid? The shop or something? Yeah, but why don't we head back to the apartments first? Take a quick breather. Which lesson was that again? Lesson one. Got it? Anyway, let's go. I can sleep easy knowing you're around. Looks like Weimar was right about you. The watch is saying they're gonna step up their game. Huh? Someone's back awful early. Not that I mind. Would you two be dears and swap your filters out for me? I left them in your rooms. Sure thing. Not so fast, you. Do me a favor. She needs a friend. A real friend. Uh, we're already friends. So when she talks, are you really listening? Thinking about her and her feelings? Or are you just going through the motions? Go on. Let's take care of this real quick, okay? Sure. Come over when you're done. One sec. I'll be done in a bit. Ah, <sighs> oh, finally. <sighs> so, after you left the village. I let you off the hook before, back at the hall, but not this time. Uh. Uh. Hmm? Well, when we were kids, everybody wanted to be a soldier, right? Yeah, I remember they were on the news every day during the war. Thing is, by the time I finally made it in, they didn't need heroes anymore. It was nothing like what we dreamt of. It was just working for Shinra. Just... Uh. 
I'm sorry. I know it's a touchy subject. Oh. Not exactly small talk. Especially with someone you haven't seen in a while. I get it. Still, it's kind of funny. Us going our separate ways, thinking that must be it. That we'd never meet again. And then here of all places we do. You know what? We should totally celebrate. Let's dress up and hit the town. Really? I mean, why not? It'll be fun. Do you even have fancy clothes? Not like fancy fancy, but I'll figure something out. What do you think would suit me, huh? Something sporty? I don't think that'd be so different from my usual. Be sure to pick an outfit that goes with mine, okay? Will do. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. You'll see. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> and on that happy note, I think it's time we head back to the bar. Come on. Uh, you don't need a break? Honestly, I'm feeling pretty good. Marl isn't always right, you know. We took care of the filters, so we're gonna head back to the bar now. Take care, you two. Oh, you're looking pretty chipper. Uh, I don't feel that different. Must be my imagination, then. <laughs> anyway, keep your wits about you, Merc. A token of my appreciation. Be good to her. You'll get no second chances from me. Gotta admit, the watch is a lot more impressive than it was a couple of years back. If there's anything you require, please do not hesitate to ask. I will be here if you require anything else. At all times, I am remotely analyzing your combat data and monitoring your progress. Took some real where it is. You got to do No one down here fights like you. Gotta say, you're awesome. Got the charge of friends left. Take a picture, why don't you? You're a wonderful exterminator. Tifa! Why do I stop by later? You gonna bless us with your cooking tonight? And here we are. You must be tired. Same as you, I guess. Could use a little something to take the edge off, right? How about a refreshing cocktail made by yours truly that you can sit back and savor? Tifa. Yeah, I'm feeling it a bit too. Hey, do you think you'll stick around a little longer? <sighs> Maybe. Work for a minute, build up some savings. I see. So, what'll it be? Wanna head back out for a little while? We're back. Did you have fun? <laughs> Lots of fun. Hey! Need y'all downstairs. Uh, right now? Then the plan is... Marlene, wanna go wait for Jesse out front? Okay. <sighs> Looks like we're officially on for tomorrow night then. Gotta go over the details with the others. 
Before you do, about my pay. You'll get your money. So sit down and shut up until we're finished. Double time, Tifa. Sorry, but it shouldn't take much longer. In the meantime, <laughs> grab a seat. What'll it be? I don't know. Something hard and bitter. <laughs> Most people would say something sweet right about now. I'm sure they would. Ah, uh, but you're a more discerning customer, aren't you? In which case... Our house special, the Cosmo Canyon. Beautiful. I gotta go. Uh, enjoy. Huh? Hey, you see the news? The reactor bombing was the work of the eco-extremist group Avalanche. Public enemy number one. Gets your heart racing, doesn't it? They don't know our faces, so we're in the clear for now. But we'll want to capitalize on this momentum. Speaking of which, you coming on the next one? For the right price. Oh, you can bet I'll be pushing hard for a raise. <sighs> Tifa will be joining us too, but I don't know. Even a blind man can see her heart's not in it. She was never on board with the bombings. So if it comes down to do or die... If I've got to put my life in someone else's hands, then... I'd rather that someone was a professional, like you. Could still kill some time. Deal, huh?
Maybe just chill a bit. I heard you're having second thoughts. I know we have to think big if we're going to make a difference. But not like this. I just... I feel trapped. If it feels wrong, don't do it. kick you out we agreed to disagree so you want another drink Tifa time to celebrate break out all the good stuff oh sure <laughs> we won't be needing you for this next job feel free to look for work elsewhere fine by me that's how I like it no contract no obligation. Figured you'd say that. Here, the rest of your payment, along with a little extra for your exemplary service. And thus concludes our business. Gonna have to ask you to leave now. This here is a private affair. Sorry. I tried. We talked it over, but... In the end... We didn't want to put so much on you. This is our fight. Jesse, what's the holdup? Uh, be right there! No hard feelings, huh? It's fine. Let's talk more after I'm done here, okay? Really, it's fine. Come on, Jesse, I'm dying here! Uh, I'll catch you later. To keep you thirsty boys waiting. Avalanche! <laughs> <sighs> that hit the spot. Damn, bit. We'll talk later. I promise. Sorry, you were saying? Keep it tight. Ain't no room for air come tomorrow. More reason to. Oh, no. You better not be about to ask for more money. Okay, what were we talking about? Yep, best way to clear your head so you can focus when it counts. It's been too long since we did this. We were all pushing real hard for you, you know? So, where'd we leave off? They did not give us the boot. Sorry, boss man wasn't having it. Oh, my bad. Continue. Uh, just thinking about it's making me mad again. I don't know how we managed. Well, I do. What's up with them? Word is he lives in this town. Just shut up and wait. We'll find him soon enough. <sighs> hey, brother. You from around the way? I guess. No big man with a big gun strapped to his right arm? Heard he set up shop somewhere in the neighborhood. 500. 200. Mm, three. Whatever, man. Let's find somewhere quiet to talk. Walk with me. Hey. Got something to say? What? You looking what? at me? You'll be fine. Is he with them? Hey. Move it! 
I said move! Look at all these assholes staring at us. This shithole's got nothing on Walmart. All right? Word Don't of advice, Blondie. Don't piss They're off my friend here. Friends. You'll be real sorry. Unless you got some kind of death wish, then be my guest. <laughs> After you, brother. Don't worry. I ain't the backstabbing type. Most days. Spill it! You know where the bastard's hiding, don't you? I told you before. That depends. Oh yeah? You wasted my time! Shinra's time, you mean? <laughs> Shinra knows better than to stick its nose in my boss's business. Like I give a shit. No holding back. Right here! Come on! <laughs> Whatever. Here we go. So long. Try me. Big man with a big gun for an arm, right? Why do you want it? Nobody tells me skin. Let me walk away. Please! Get out of here! Won't last long. Any time now. It's over. So if they weren't Shinra, then... Not my problem. Lesson one for life on the ground floor. Get some rest. We can talk in private. Guess I'll get right to the point then. Huh. What have you got there? An apology for not getting you on the mission. Uh. Or not. What do you think it is? <sighs> A proposition. Nailed it in one. Gonna have to ask you to keep all this a secret from the others, though. It's a personal matter. Something I need to sort out tonight. Tonight? Tonight. You and me, together. I want you to come with me to the Sector 7 plate. I'll give you the details on the way. That's fine by me, but don't you have a pretty big day ahead of you? I do, but if I don't deal with this now... It's only gonna get harder. Anyway, I can count on you, can't I? Hmm. Oh. A down payment. Doubt we'll be back before morning, in case you were planning on traveling light. Make sure you've got everything you need before we leave. I'll wait here.
You all set? Awesome. Meet me at the station after dark. Don't be late. <sighs> it's just another job. Tough break. They changed the times. The last train's already left. Which is why we borrowed these bikes. Need a lift to the plate? How did you guess? Easy. You've been acting weird. Like talking about one thing when you're obviously thinking about something else. Yeah, and don't get me started on all that pep. All right, I'll give you that. But how did you know I wanted to head topside? Was I talking in my sleep? What else did I say? No, we just figured you wanted to see your parents, that's all. Nailed it, huh? Yep, right on the head. So, seeing as we don't have any family of our own, how about you let us be a part of yours for a bit? You know, spread the wealth. Hmm. Are your parents still around? Huh? Uh, no. Mm -hmm. <sighs> okay then, guess you're all invited. Here's to awkward family reunions! Yeah! yeah! I take it you boys have your brand spanking new IDs? Yes, ma'am. Then let's lay down some rubber. Try that frog. Okay, you got it. You hear me? Yeah. Just so you know, I'm not going plate side for the reason they think I am. Look, you saw the way the reactor went up. It was huge, right? Because of all the Mako. Isn't that what you said? Yeah. That was wishful thinking. Deep down, I know it was my fault. I used a more powerful blasting agent than the directions called for. It had nothing to do with the Mako. Let's say you're right. So what? I'm planning on using a weaker blasting agent this time. But, since I can't get in touch with my supplier, our only option is to loot a warehouse owned by Shinra. Shinra? Good luck with that. With your help, we won't need luck. Don't be absurd. As if I could ever grow tired of your company. Naughty, naughty! Until one of our flames is forever extinguished, our fates will never rest! <laughs> Coming for me! Room! <laughs> oh ho ho! Come on, let's push it past the red line! Jesse, take over. Huh? <laughs> 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 well, well, well. I do believe this round is yours. <laughs> Maybe next time we can keep it just between the two of us. Maybe. <laughs> Until we meet again, my friend! We did it! Go team! 
Don't get too excited. Reinforcements are hot on our trail. You failed the test. What test? Driving. I'm great at driving. <laughs> great at scaring your passengers, more like. Not used to having any. Maybe you should just let me drive. Nope. <laughs> Guess I'll take one for the team and be your back warmer again. Would you look at that? It's the end of the ride. <sighs> we'll go on foot from here. Don't want to draw too much attention to ourselves. Hey, did these things leave a mark? <laughs> they got you pretty good. Oh, and I'm running on fumes. <laughs> Don't worry. We'll top you up soon enough. Now let's roll. residential areas just beyond this gate. Mind doing the honors? <sighs> district where they put you when your parents work for Shinra all their reactors were slowly killing the planet we were living the good life Someone's playing hard to get. The folks here must be living off three or four times what I do. comes home once every other blue moon. Mom's an old-fashioned type like that. Think she'll make us pizza? Her Midgar special? She's quite the cook. Quick to whip up finger-licking food, even if you drop by in the dead of night. And she loves guests who ask for seconds or thirds. 
Okay, let's head in. Cloud, you know what to do. Why don't you wait around the corner over there? Ah, okay. It's a shame you won't get to try the Midgar special. You would have really liked it. With your help, we won't need luck. You'll take on just about any job, right? Well, I need you to rob my house. Think you can do that for me? Huh. Go in through the back door when the coast is clear. The signal will be obvious. Once the lights come on, it's go time. Time to go. Inside, you'll find a room with two doors. Don't take the one in front of you. You want the room on the right. That's where you'll find it. Sorry about dropping in like this again. This will always be your home. So, how's practice going? <laughs> Going? You get so fixated, lose sight of things. That's why I'm glad you've got a raw clock fix. We'll be chatting mom up in the kitchen, so don't even bother being quiet. There's no way she'll ever hear you. Dad'll be in there, but it's okay. I need you to grab his Shinra ID card. And yeah, I know I should do it myself, but... <laughs> but I honestly don't think I'm up to it. Just do this for me, okay? Now that is a damn good pie. This isn't it. Jesse. What's this? Dear Mom and Dad, sorry for not getting in touch sooner, but I'm working at the Gold Saucer as an actress now. It wasn't easy, and I had a lot of help from people along the way, but I managed to land a starring role and closed our two tickets to my play. Looking forward to seeing you both there. Jesse Raspberry as the princess? My dad. He was a maintenance supervisor at the reactor. Thanks.
<laughs> Wedge, don't hurt yourself. Please, take more. Mission accomplished. When are you going to give up on the gold saucer? How long has it been since you even performed? Uh... A lot of people really rely on Jesse. As a stagehand though, right? You can be one of those anywhere. So why not come home and get a job at the Sector 8 Theater? Uh, I'll think about it. You know, I'd really love to stay and chat, but we gotta go. So soon? Yeah, well, we hadn't even planned on dropping by. But Wedge wanted some of your famous mm. pizza. So good. Sure I can't tempt you with some more? Maybe just a couple slices, Mrs. R. Wedge! Hey, I'm, I'm doing it for you guys. You don't want me going to work on an empty stomach. I'm planning on using a weaker blasting agent this time. Since I can't get in touch with my supplier, our only option is to loot a warehouse owned by Shinra. Hey there. This it? Now comes the hard part. I'm gonna use this to sneak into the 7-6 Annex. <sighs> Alright, let's get to it. Sorry, but you're staying outside. Only I know what to steal from where, so it's gotta be me who goes in. So, we came all this way just to eat pizza? <laughs> you think I'd let you off that easy? You're gonna earn every slice helping Cloud. Just do the thing where you draw everyone's attention away, like you did at my parents. What's the word again? Maybe I'm more nervous than I thought. Diversion. Yeah, that. Nice one, military man. So what? Does this mean we're gonna ask some Shinra folks out to dinner? Uh, you know damn well what she means. Uh, While you're inside, we make sure the guards are focused on the outside, yeah? Exactly. Couldn't have put it any better. When you see a flare go up, that's your cue. Rush the front gates and make for the warehouse plaza. The more hell you raise, the more time you buy me. Huh. You're gonna run this guy into the ground, aren't you? How much time do you think you'll need? Not too much. I'll be in and out. I'll send up another flare when I'm done. We rendezvous in the vacant lot up ahead. Hold on. How are we supposed to get back to the slums? Wait for the first train? No. I want to be back before that. Don't worry. I have something worked out. Now, let's get this done. <laughs> well, that diversion's not gonna create itself. Jesse's dad was in there, right? Yeah. Mako poisoning. <sighs> Happened while Jesse was doing a show with the gold saucer. Ah. But what do you care? No. I want to hear it. Jesse always wanted to be an actress. Worked her ass off for years. Until finally she caught a break. Top billing. Parents were thrilled. And then, right before opening night, her dad had an accident. Collapsed from overwork. And in the worst possible place, Mako Storage. Lay there half a day before someone found him. Been like that ever since. No change whatsoever. And that's what got her into planetology. And led her to seek out Avalanche. How far we've come. Jesse's got a theory about it. Thinks her dad's spirit is stuck now. Between his body and the heart of the planet. So if we don't shut down the reactors soon... He'll get caught up in the flow and... Poof. <laughs> What's so funny? Just that I understand how you feel. Unlike most of the time. I see. Mako's the essence of life itself. Of memory and hope. It's not something you burn in a reactor just to keep the lights on. Hell no. Don't tell Jessie about this little chat, okay? When she gets pissed, 
Ooh, she gets punchy. Well, no promises. He's serious, Cloud. She'll beat the shit out of us. Not my problem. This guy. Hey, it's the lot Jesse was talking about. We run into here when we've got what we came for. Gotta stay hidden. Wait for the signal. It's so quiet. Just need to get past this gate. Wait. Where are the guards? here and I don't think it was Jesse this had better not get in the way of our plans it won't huh? don't see anyone what the hell happened hey man the plaza's that way warehouses are further in Jesse's supposed to be circling around from the back right Let's go. Need for us to rush. Let's scout it out first. I can handle this solo. What? You're trying to keep us out of it now? Don't be a jackass. We're in this together. Don't expect me to save you. If you need to check your gear, now's the time. Give the word when you're good to go. You can use that vending machine over there to stock up. Guess there's a training center too. Could go a few rounds before the main event. Man, I get really hungry when I'm nervous. Remind me, you've got summoning materia, don't you? There's no better way to deal with big groups. You'd be crazy not to equip it. Okay, let's go over the plan one last time. <sighs> you start things off by cutting loose where everyone can see you. <laughs> and us? We're the backup. First, we climb high enough to get a vantage point, then we go to town on them.
Hey ya. So, what did you want to talk about? When spring comes, I'm leaving town. I'm going to Midgar. Should have figured. All the guys are leaving. But, but I'm not like them. I'm not going just to look for work. I'm going to be a soldier. The best of the best. Like Sephiroth. The great war hero, huh? Hmm. Isn't it pretty hard to become a soldier? Yeah. So I won't be back for a long time. Guess not. Think you'll be in the papers? I'll try. Just promise me one thing. When we're older, and you're a famous soldier, if I'm ever trapped or in trouble, promise you'll come and save me. Huh? That's what heroes do. They save people. Please? Just once. Uh... Come on, promise me. Fine. I promise. you're having second thoughts. I know we have to think big if we're going to make a difference. But not like this. I just... I feel trapped. <sighs> That's the signal! <sighs> All according to plan. Let's go. Right. Yeah! I don't see any intruders. Maybe they went home. Over there! Tar target sighted! <laughs> Shit me. Give me a bit. 
bit more time and I got you. Give it up! Putting up a fight, huh? Let's do this. I'll show you. Yeah. All right. Go to hell! Yeah! You can't win. Looking good. So much for being a mercenary.
think I ran off the pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Hell of a show, man. If only the ladies loved you that much. I'm glad someone's enjoying themselves. Of course they store mechs here. You ready? Hell yeah! More than you know! Look what I found! Let's give these jerks a taste of their own medicine! <laughs> You know what I want. A second chance. Just the two of us. You turn the key. The engine roars with excitement. It hungers to be set free! Fall back. Uh, uh, right. Uh, Come on. Uh, uh. It's 
been a long time since I fought a duel out of the saddle. But, for all the miles on the clock... I'm just as fast as I ever was! Alright. Satisfied? <laughs> With such fleeting pleasure? Hardly. <sighs> there are higher heights to which you and I can still soar. this again until then try not to die I'll see you on the road my friend <laughs> Damn it. Yours is... 
Come here. Wedge will be fine, but you won't be if they start asking questions. And who are they? First guests to the party, another avalanche cell. Our holier-than-thou friends from the old guard. <laughs> it's always their way or the highway. Lately, they've been a real pain in the ass. Till now. So then why are they here? Beats me. We've been on the outs ever since our cell got labeled too extreme. Though they're the ones running around with mil-spec gear. Word is, they've cut a deal with Wu-Tai. Promised them all the materia in Midgar, apparently. Think there's any truth to that? You tell me. Sometimes, I think we're the only ones who've realized the war's over. <sighs> okay. Mission complete. Let's make our way back to the lot. Right. Looking a lot more crowded now. Security's out in force. Yeah, just what we need. So, are we not gonna wait for Wedge? If we stuck around or went back, he'd only get upset. Why is that? Because the soldier wouldn't understand. I'll tell him you're worried about it, you know? Many of our citizens have already been disturbed by the alarm. Squad A will set up here to search for suspects. We will establish a perimeter. Roadblocks included. Contain the situation. You made it! Over here! Security will only serve the fight with Okay! Let's go! Could you have been any louder? I mean, it made my job a lot easier, but... Wait, where's Wedge? <sighs> Wedge! <sighs> that was close. We'll go get him. <laughs> hey, buddy. How you doing? <sighs> Come on. Not my finest hour. You get hit? Just winged, I think. Or oh, shot! Really? Let me see. Are we seriously doing this here? That's... Wow. You guys are the worst. Huh? Your ass is fine. Maybe singed, but the only casualty is your underwear. This is like a bruise or a mild burn at worst. <gasps> now that was a gunshot. <laughs> is that a smile I spy? Mm -hmm. uh, um, it's not safe here. We should go. <laughs> Copy, Copy that. that. So, how do we get back to the slums? <laughs> With a little trick I've been dying to try out. Residents are to return to their homes and remain indoors until further notice. I repeat, for your safety, go home. I heard someone say it was an attack. Hey, it was those terrorists, right? There has been no attack. For your safety, please go home and remain indoors until further notice. An emergency has been declared. All civilians are to remain in place with cooperation with the Right, this is it. Through here and we're home free. Where exactly are we going? When we get there, you'll know. Now that I've got my blasting agent, 
We should have everything we need for our next mission. Sure hope so. Yeah, me too. For your dad's sake. Hey, what the hell, man? Huh? Uh, Cloud was just saying how he hoped to come back and try the Midgar special next time. Really, huh? Cloud said that? Sure did. Wants a whole pie to himself. Isn't that right? That's... that's right. Really? Well, okay then. Maybe I'll lend Mom a hand next time. That'd be awesome! Super duper awesome! Should be somewhere around here. Bingo. I have figured my dad got it wrong, but nope. They're here just like he said. Parachutes? Mm -hmm. Huh? What do you mean, half figured? 50 50 is pretty good odds if you ask me. <laughs> this is w gonna be wait, fun. Uh, 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 <sighs> Thanks, guys. I really appreciate you coming all this way with me. And like I said before, I'd be grateful if you kept this between us until after the mission. I don't want to complicate things. Sure. Okay, who's ready to fly? Me, me! Hey, Cloud, you let him down gently, all right? Yep. Wait, I almost forgot. One more thing. Whoa! Whoa. Stop, Stop it! Whoa. What in the hell are you trying to... Uh. Ooh, uh, easy, you'll make us fall! Not if you do first! <sighs> Swing by my place after, so I can pay you in full. No! <laughs> Wait! Give me a minute! No. Why you have to be such a hard-ass bro? I ain't your bro. <laughs> done more just got hurt you did enough you took one for the team be proud yeah yeah <laughs> feels like we're flying high these days <laughs> now more than ever he's a keeper all right yeah together we can take on the world home on my own. After all, I'm only a little sore. <laughs> That's cool. We'll go together. Aw, thanks, bro. <sighs> Cut that out. <laughs> this way. Think Jesse and Biggs made it back safe? I guess. Cool if we check on them? Huh? We'll pass by their places anyway. Sure. You saw it too, right? Well, this is Big's place. I guess he hasn't made it home yet. Guess not. Hope he isn't worst casing it again. He's got a habit of overthinking things. Worrying about all the possible outcomes till his head hurts. Wouldn't have guessed. And when he worries, I worry. <laughs> anyway, let's head on over to Jesse's.
stayed up all night thinking about the reactor. This is where Jesse lives. Men are not allowed inside. Mm. Lots of pretty girls trying to make it big on stage live here. So don't hang around or they might get the wrong idea. Huh. I'm telling you this for your own good, Cloud. People around here love to gossip. They know about Jesse and Avalanche? Nah, it's all good. They think she's an actress. Oh, and one more thing, bro. It's all a game to her. Don't fall for it. You lost me. <laughs> Life's a stage and loves to play. Reggie, Smalls, brought a new friend to meet you. These little guys are on guard duty today. Okay. Thanks for seeing me home. Really sorry about your ass. It's all good, bro. It's kind of weird when you call me that. Hey, don't be scared. Deep down, he's a big softie. It's okay. It's okay. <sighs> Good job, guys. It? Great work. Aw, oh, I missed you too. Oh, Big Ums acting so tough. And you, Reggie, you are just the cutest. Aw, Smalls, do you want a belly rub? Hey, bro. Wanna chill with me and the gang for a bit? Uh, who's the gang? The cats, dummy! Who else? Bigamous Rex? Reginaldo? Mr. Smalls? Right. I'm gonna try to find some living work. Well, if it isn't Cloud Strife, was wondering when you'd show up. Without further ado, here you are. Thanks for stepping up, Merc. <laughs> and now for the cherry on top. Oh. Okay, I get it. Mind letting me breathe? Depends. Mind coming over tomorrow night? My roommates should all be out for a while. Are you seriously that desperate? Just let go already. Only if you promise to come back tomorrow night. Deal? <sighs> no promises. But I'll think it over. Really? You will? I'd make a mean pizza, I'll have you know. Marsh, Louche, Black Millie, Red Shelly? I use only the best ingredients. Sound good? Uh, never heard of any of that stuff. Oh, you are so adorable, you know that? You just leave everything to me. It'll be great. <laughs> Nighty night. Psych. Bad idea. Cloud, survive the jump? How's Wedge? He's fine. <sighs> well, that's good to hear. Tomorrow's a really big day for all of us. When Wedge said he'd been shot, 
I was afraid we'd have to call off the whole damn thing. Heading topside in secret. Don't think I could have faced Barrett if something had happened. But Jesse had been acting weird, and I knew I couldn't just ignore her. Biggs. She must be prepping the bomb right now. Or will she be able to finish before morning? I should go and see if she needs any. Biggs. Huh? Uh. Sorry. Our chute was blown pretty far off course. It felt like a bad omen or something. So. Get some rest. You need it. Roger. Night. Night. And thanks, really. Lesson one for life on the ground floor. A good long rest will cure anything. Thanks for the refresher. Asleep. Yeah. You were out for a while. Just walking. I ran into Johnny, by the way. Said not to worry. He was getting out of town. Uh... Oh, that guy. You weren't thinking of leaving Midgar anytime soon, were you? Hmm. Well, seems this old friend of mine's in a tight spot. A long time ago, I said I'd be there for her. Made a promise. So... <sighs> Can't say this is quite what I had in mind when I put that on you way back when. If you want to talk, I'm listening. Huh? What's with you all of a sudden? With me? <laughs> like you're losing that hard edge. That bad? Not at all. I like it. Maybe Marlene won't be so scared of you next time. <laughs> I'm really glad to have you back, Cloud. Really glad. Oh, it's pretty late, huh? I'd like to catch up more, but we should probably both get some sleep, yeah? Yeah. Good night, then. Good night, Tifa. showed up and came after us. The others? Barrett and Jesse are holding their ground, but for how long? I don't know. Let's go. Right. Ready? You know it. Let's head for the bar. Is 
this even working? Hang in there! I see you. This is stupid. It's over. There's way too many of them. Try me. There's no end to this. That's right. see them unless they make physical contact first. That's all you can tell me? I can tell you they're not invincible. I guess that's something. More of them? We're running out of time. Any other way? Yeah, over here.
I shouldn't be surprised, though. Never can tell what weird shit'll come crawling out of the scrap down here. It's those reactors. I'm telling you. It hurt? Wish I could say it didn't, but... yeah. <laughs> God, this is so embarrassing. I hate playing the damsel in distress. It happens. What did you do to your leg? D d d does it hurt? Not nearly as much as the fuss everyone's making. Still, I think you ought to avoid putting any- I'm fine! <clears throat> oh. Oh. <sighs> That's enough. You're out, Jesse. Huh? What about the mission? We already sent Biggs in, remember? Don't tell me you're thinking of calling it off! Uh, no, we got this. The hell you do. If you need someone to step up, I'm your man! <coughs> okay. So here's the thing. I'm gonna need a raise. 
Consider it done. All right, everyone. Clouds in. The mission is on. Go and raise some help for me, okay? <laughs> Listen, Wedge. I need you to hang back and guard the home front. What? But I'm in perfect health! Which makes you the perfect choice to look after Jesse and Marlene. <sighs> hey. Let's get this show on the road to Marco Reactor 5. Once you got your gear in order, head to the station for the meet. Got it? Hmm. <laughs> This will help you get squared away. Don't tell me I never did nothing for you. I'm counting on you, soldier boy. I'm counting on you, bro. Don't let anything happen to the others. Good luck out there, bro, and take care. Relegated to stagehand once again. I'm starting to think I'll never have a starring role. There's always next time. What's this? Words of encouragement? <laughs> Thanks. I need them. Hurry back now. You don't want my home-cooked pizza to get cold. All right. Let's get going. Sure. After you take a deep breath. Huh? I can tell you're nervous. That obvious, huh? Okay. I'm ready now. Just got done talking. Shin was gonna stop him, right? What the fuck? Avalanche is the real thing, I said. Hmm? Moving down. Slump. Maybe a slump slider for lunch. Bombs and steppers. Please do not hesitate to ask. I will be here if you require anything else. At all times, I am remotely analyzing your combat data and monitoring your progress. I heard they're running on an emergency. I can't wait any longer. It's okay. Bye, people. Mission starts the moment we board that train. You sure you ready for this? Do you think Biggs is... on schedule? All we can do is hope. Today really gotta be the day, huh? Ain't no stopping this train we're on, son. A lot of people risk their lives to get it rolling. Already put the word out, more's coming too. Shut them all down by the day, or we shut another down for you. Ain't on us, not us. Play it cool.
avalanche has issued another bomb threat. In response, we have raised the threat level and entered a state of heightened alert. All lines are currently experiencing delays. We anticipate that our arrival in Sector 4 will be later than scheduled. The targets Marco Reactor 5. From the station, we take the back streets. Once we're inside the facility, it's the same deal as last time. Head for Marco storage. And then, blow it all to hell. Let's do this one for Jesse and Wedge. They deserve it. Yeah. Sure. I didn't think word would spread this fast. There's barely anyone on this train, and none of them look happy to be here. Might stand out as a group. You two stay here. <laughs> First hurdle. Not much of one. I know, I know, but that doesn't mean I don't have butterflies in my stomach. <sighs> hey, would you mind keeping an eye on things the next car over? I'm worried there might be trouble. Why is that? Barrett's always on edge before missions. But you know he's a good guy underneath it all. The people on this train don't. He'll be fine. Maybe. But I won't be until I know for sure. Be right back. Thanks. <laughs> None of this has faced you at all, has it? Comes with being a soldier. They train you to be ready for anything. Wish I was. Keep an eye on Barrett for me, would you? So, do you still support those terrorists? Avalanche is a blight on Midgar. Huh? Their bomb threat has thrown our offices into chaos, let alone the reactor itself. It's total insanity! But we won't lose heart. No! Everyone at Shinra agrees. The reactor will stay online. <laughs> Is that right? Uh, what? You got a problem with that? Do I have a problem with that? Oh, you can bet. He doesn't. You know you're better than that. <laughs> Go see how Tifa's doing. She needs you more than I do. I have nothing more to say to you and your friend. Emergency ID scan in 
progress. Huh? No what way! Emergency ID scan in progress. Unauthorized IDs detected. Threat level critical. <laughs> Inspection and containment sweep initiated. Commencing at the rear of the train. Not good. Get over here! Now! <laughs> <laughs> Take care of them, Cloud! On it. Lockdown protocol. You have to get to the next level. Keep holding, people! What do we do? Get the car, too! That we can't! You want to survive this? Lockdown protocol initiated. Lockdown shortly. Move it! Please, you have to get out of here! What are you doing? Trying to keep you alive. But I work for Shinra. I'm the enemy. I don't care. I don't want anyone to die. Please. I'll look after the others. My turn. <laughs> There's no end to that. Three unauthorized passengers successfully consent neutralizing the threat. Looks like you're right, soldier boy. Screw this. The station will be crawling with security. We gotta jump. Screw that. We need to slow the train down. <laughs> Sounds like a big plan E. <laughs>
Speaking of which, where's the third? In custody, sir. Return it to the wild. Yes, sir. Right away.
You have nothing to worry about, sir. Preparations for the grand finale are proceeding without incident. I have the utmost confidence that everything will play out as you intended. Yes, of course. I will not fail you, sir. No. Sir, analytics reports that the results fall within the admissible range. However, the casualty rate significantly exceeds previous projections. Ah. Remind me what your job is. Is it to question the wisdom of your superiors and bemoan your personal hardships? Sir? Huh. Casualty rate. You think I care about the casualty rate? They're pawns in a greater game. If your stock runs low, then go round up more for Sector 3 or wherever else. Use your head and bring me solutions instead of problems for a change, yes? Sir. It is so hard to find good help these days. Which is why the President ought to count his blessings. What would he do without me? Drag it out. No need to be, really.
trust. Good thing our colleagues put up all that stamp graffiti. Without it, we'd be lost for sure. Must have missed it. What's that? Nothing good. Guys, I think it might be a nest. All kinds of creepy crawlers make themselves at home in the plate. They'd get messed up even more by the Marco. Marco to this? No, not Marco. Shit. What? That black and white worm, boys. You like it, huh? You know this one. Nothing. Ah! <laughs> this gun! Shit!
day. Check his notes. This isn't bad, you know. Yeah, they really captured the essence of corporate propaganda. Check it out. I guess she was doing something about those monsters after all. Doing a half-assed job, hey, looks like. How do we get such a shit detail? Screw it. Let's just give it a quick once-over and call it a day. Piled our report on Avalanche's combat capabilities and our <clears throat> report, report, report. What good do you think a damn report will do anyone? I don't. Have you already forgotten the war with Wu Tai? An enemy spared is an enemy who will repay your kindness with blood. We must crush them thoroughly and completely, without hesitation or mercy. Shinra cannot, and will not, settle for anything less! Will you? B but sir... If so, I can only assume that you and your men no longer wish to serve in your current positions. Is that correct? We'll prepare the prototype in Section E for immediate deployment. Right now, damn it! Another day, another victory. How do I do it?
going to get away this time! For a shower. So many guards. Too many. Keep looking for faithful little stead. He'll lead us to the passageway. This 
ですね Get back!
Analytics reports that the feed went down after an anomaly was registered during the test. An anomaly? Or an excuse for your failure to properly prepare the armor? No, sir. All modules were confirmed fully operational. It's far more likely, given the circumstances, that the sensors were overloaded. Is that so? All the sensors in Section E are inoperable. The President. Yes. Yes. Everything is fine, sir. Better, even. There's been a development. 
Yes. Understood, sir. We know exactly where they were headed. If the armor is intact, then you'd best determine the nature of this anomaly soon. Should you fail to do so, you will deal with our intruders personally. Uh, yes, sir. Don't worry. I treat my people more than fairly. <laughs> so don't disappoint me. Passages beyond these shipping containers. Let's slip through them. Talk about a tight squeeze. You okay? Yeah. So, you bump into any giant robots like that in Reactor 1? Yeah, except the bastard looked like a scorpion. Speaking of which, what would you say that last one looked like? Huh? Uh, well... Hmm. Looks dead now. Lo and behold. All aboard. Just so you know, it's not going to get any easier. <laughs> when did it ever? straight on to Reactor 5. You make it sound so simple. <laughs> Only because it is. That there's the Reactor Support Pillar. So what's the plan? After plan E comes F, G, and then H. <sighs> Thought E was the last. <laughs> this here is Section F. We cut through Section G and head for H. A cargo platform in H will get us closer to the reactor. Biggs should be somewhere over there. Looks like the sun's going down on Midgar. Right. Double time. We got a date with the reactor. <laughs>
air below us. Shut up and move. Just don't look down, okay? Easy for you to say. Section G's through here, huh? This ought to open it. No good? Needs power, I think. That looks more like what we need. Control room. Let's check it out. Maybe no one uses that entrance. I'm getting the feeling no one's come down here for a long time. No plate inspectors, huh? for dealing with a power shortage. Kill the lights, and we free up power for the gate and other stuff. Sun lamps. You think these are the plate suns? The closest thing we have to the real thing. Gotta put out a sun just to open a gate, huh? But if we go through with it, the grounders in Sector 4 will suffer. Now or later, sun's going out for good when we blow the reactor. That's true. Let's go. These lamps. You'd think they'd be able to balance the load by now. Maybe. If the maintenance guys or whoever weren't playing looking. The lamps are important, but when you think how much Mako it must take to keep them running. That's gotta be one. Man, look at the size of it. That a console I see near the top of that ladder. A uh pretty tall ladder too. I'll go. Okay, we'll wait down here. Disengaging locking mechanisms. Okay, that's that. <laughs> Great job, Cloud. Next stop, Section G. Yep, and after that, Reactor 5. I'm sure those things will welcome us just as warmly as before. <laughs> Tell you what, the rot runs deep in this damn pizza.
They busted? Powered down, is my guess. Lucky us, am I right? One less thing for us to worry about. that <sighs> gotta go where the catwalks take us <laughs> fill in the head if we gotta breathe with this shit monsters sure seem to like it what's up with that it's like in the tunnels they get twisted by the mako but it all goes back to shit Get lost is to believe that you're not. Mind over matter. Isn't that from one of Marlene's books? Yep, one of her favorites. Loves it when I read it to her before bedtime. Doing all the voices. Life in the Endless Maze. Am I right? <laughs> I remember. get our bearings. We're still in G, right? Yeah, and to reach Mako Reactor 5, we need to go through Section H. Okay. Unfortunately, I didn't spot a connecting catwalk to Section H. Did you? Well, we could always do another lap. Go for 10, why don't you? The only other route that I can think of would be... Along the wall. Up for giving it a try? It might not work out, but it's the only idea I've got. <laughs> it's not a bad one. So we're shooting for those giant fans way over there? Okay. At least we've got a clear landmark to guide us. Those ventilation fans? Keeping the plates air clean by pushing the smog into the slums. Whole system's designed to make shit roll downhill fast. <laughs> Yeah, I 
Because our soldiers were meant to be the best. Watch yourself. onto that pipe. Sure seems that way. Damn it. No fear, no fear. Yeah, no fear. No fear. No fear. No fear. No fear. Little fear. Hey guys, um, you know, these fans are really loud and you chickening out? Hell no! I'm just worried that your bony ass is gonna get blown off the side and shit. Enough! We gotta keep moving. Okay, then. Follow me. <laughs> no worse than a windy day, huh? One with a tornado warning, maybe? Don't look at the fan. Whatever you do. Right. Just up ahead. Slow and steady, guys. And that's our objective? The cargo platform? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the one. This is it. The cargo platform Biggs was talking about. Let's not keep him waiting. Insufficient power. You're kidding me. Needs three lights worth, looks like. But that's... That's all of them, isn't it? All or nothing. Let's regroup here if we get lost. Remember the H1 sign. Right. Let's see now. Closest light ought to be... That one. By the light of these magnificent lamps, we shall lead our brothers and sisters of the Undercity to a brighter future. Say what? It's from a speech President Shinra gave, talking up the importance of the sun lamps. Tuh. Brighter future, my ass. Shinra's leading us down a one-way path to darkness and death.
Where's the switch? Let's flip it and go. Rerouting power. Please wait. That's one down. Only two more lights to go. Reinitializing intrusion prevention system. Intrusion prevention? Back online because of us. <laughs> no need to fret, y'all. A few rusty mechs ain't gonna keep us from reaching the reactor. Detected. Engaging countermeasures. Mid-range turrets, huh? Hey, Cloud! Hang back while I deal with these pests! Huh. I'm, on this. I'm waiting. Huh. Get all you got! It's on you. Okay, uh, let's go. Need my help, do you? See ya! Worked up a good sweat just when I arrived. We can move this catwalk. Yeah! Lined it up perfect! Which way to the next light? If we can't make sense of this place, we're gonna get lost. Well, at least we know where the big ass things are. No match for me. You keep telling yourself that. You're nothing. Once more, I'm counting on you. I got you. It's on now. Any time now. Not throwing in the towel. Bring it. Any time now. Bring it on. All right. That's it. I'll find you coming. All right. Watch and learn. Ooh, gotta love cool. No thing. <laughs> Nothing to it. That makes two lights down. Meaning we've only got one left. The end in sight, y'all. Should be able to climb down from here. Uh, this a hole, right? That the Sector 4 slums down there? Huh? You want to check them out sometime? I can show you around. We'll check them out now if we fall. The real sun's the only one we need. To hell with Shinra and his night lights. Let's move, move, move! 
Not so fast. Shame we had to wander around so much. Well, no stamps here to guide us. No Jesse or Wes to back us up neither. Yeah. Speaking of which, what should we tell Biggs? I don't want him to worry. If there's no viable path, we'll just have to make one. I hope that Jesse's injury isn't anything serious. The best thing you can do to speed her recovery is to kick Shinra ass in her stead. I know, I know. And Cloud's got a cover for Wedge, too. When do we link up with Biggs? Soon enough. Don't you worry. He knew we might be late, so we came up with a few ways to kill time. We ought to reach him long before he dies of boredom. And we're back at the cargo platform. Get ready, Marco Reactor 5. We're coming. Auxiliary power supply confirmed. Reactivating cargo platform. Cargo platform activated. Awaiting input. <laughs> so long, underplate. I hate you too. <laughs> 